If you guys are looking for super cheap, fast, and reliable Madden 22 Ultimate Team coins, look no further than my sponsor, MuttReserve.com. They're super awesome to work with, and they have 24-7 support. Head over to MuttReserve.com and use code Poodle at checkout for 15% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. And today, I'm going to be going over how to use a power pass, as well as how to power up your players and get some free leads, guys. It's a pretty good video. Here's the thing, though. I know a lot of people are getting access to New Zealand today as well as I've even heard the full you game in the US as well. So I know today is the day where you guys have probably been playing the game, getting your free power passes and getting your stuff and probably wondering how to go ahead and actually use a lot of these things. I guess first and foremost, I want to apologize for making a video yesterday. It was my 21st birthday party um, two days ago, or well, maybe a day ago, and I was very sick yesterday. I was bedridden for almost 12 to 15 hours and um, my voice is very bad right now. So I'm just saying. In terms of today's videos, if I crack, my voice cracks a few times, do not, don't roast me too hard. My voice is pretty messed up, but nonetheless, guys, let's get into this video. But first, we have the Poodle Squad shout out, guys. Shout out to Hurlbert for being a part of the Poodle Squad. Thank you so much, man, for showing support each and every day. If you guys need, well, if you guys need anything, by the way, coins wise, heading down to my reserve. The store should be going live, I believe, today or tomorrow for the full game release. So if you guys need coins, head over there, use code Poodle. Make sure to sub, turn that noti bell. Always like the video. And if you want to be shout out to the Poodle Squad, like the video and comment down below Poodle Squad. But yeah, let's get into this, guys. So, first things first, many of you have been wondering how to get a power pass. This year, there are more ways than one. A few more ways than usual, actually. So, you go to you go to Ultimate Season. You come over to Levels, right? This is one of the first ways. There's easier ways, so just hold up. Do not do not click off. You're not high enough level. There's still more. Ultimate Season Rewards at level, I believe, right around here. Level 8, you get a 62 to 81 overall power pass. Now, power up passes can be used to get free base leads, pretty much, and pass. Uh, instead of having to buy the base leads to power them up. You're able to just go ahead and use it now i'm also going to be making a video how to use um how to power players in this video as well so stay tuned throughout the video for that i'm going to finish off that later so i'm just going to show you how to get them and then I'll, I'll teach you the whole bit so as we go on down guys you can see there's a few times where you do go ahead and earn them these are really high up in overall uh, level at this point level 19 you earn another one um let's see at level 28 you're another one so on and so forth you earn a few so pretty much what it is is in madden in madden in general lately you get a power card which are like 60 to 70 overall purple cards right those power cards which i will show you right now you go ahead and you get those cards and when you get those cards you are able to go ahead and, and add training to them above which you get through quick song called core elites from solos you add training to them and by adding training to them you're able to go ahead and actually this car here by the way i already started powering it up a little bit so you go to upgrades and you go all the way up here so you see the 15 that's the first one you got to click on them and you add the item into it now remember this year you can and last year you can refund them so if you don't like the card anymore or you want to get rid of it you can get rid of the training on it and you get a partial refund right so for example i'm going to power my homes a little bit so i'm short in training so as you guys see above the 35 training over there to get that you have to go quick sell base leads or quick sell gold or quick sell stuff and they will have a training value per their overall so just keep that in mind so power pass can be used like this so as you guys can see it's training 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 until you get to tier six tier six is going to be where patrick mahomes 88 basically comes in so you have to go buy the 88 mahomes basically unless you have a power pass as it says in the name it's pass like a hall pass right so if you have an 88 overall power pass you can put that in place it's like it's like a free space and bingo you put that there and the card will be powered up to his 89 mahomes without having to pay for him that's pretty cool as well now these cards are very expensive right now we don't have 88 overall power passes most of you probably don't have one yet at least so let's go to an easier card to show off here which probably would be Let's see who I have. Like a, I need like a low overall one that I'll be able to pretty quickly go ahead and do. Maybe like Chase Young, right? So Chase Young, right here for the Washington football team. Go to upgrades. So it'll be 5, 6, 10, 15, 64. He is an 82 overall player, which comes in 83. Because remember, power up brings it one overall above, which is another way to get your players up in overall. So for this one, you would need a power pass that goes to 82. So that'd be like an 82 to 84. Once again, does not complete the one that you're going to get, which is going to be the 62 to 81, which can pretty much cover up any base lead. Joe Thune will be a great example right here if you go to upgrades and you check it out. So those are a few options of the other higher power passes. It's going to be the one that you get first. So you go 4, 5, 6, uh, 10, 15, and then right here is the item. So you're going to, once you get to this item, you click it. It'll say, search for Joe Thune in the auction block, search for Joe Thune in the binder, or search for an item or whatever. Do the one with the item. In the binder, when you go to the binder, you're going to see there's going to be two options. A basically Joe Thune, you probably pulled from your Gold Saint Fantasy Packs or your Power Pass. You put that in. Now, you didn't waste it. Remember, you can refund this year. So at some point, you don't want Joe Thune anymore or any other players. You can just go ahead and just, if you click on the item that you do, so I'll show you with this one, you buy it. As soon as you buy it, you can click on it and refund it. And I will get partial training back. I got two back instead of the four, all the total four I spent. You get half. 
um, ability is different you get more than half back but this one you get half so that's pretty cool as well so that's how you use a power pass that's how you power players using the purple ones and you're gonna need a combination of their either their to power them all the way you need their purple card and their elite which is their red card or whatever full card they have or power pass to pass it so that's how you power use a power pass in terms of that now i'm going to show you guys how to get some more free power passes as well and in terms of how powering up players works in just a second as well like I, I pretty much got through some of that so if you guys come over here to play you know the, there's the campaign challenges right that campaign challenges comes with a sequence of sets that you can see over here i really like that they did this this year so i will show you guys the whole thing so if you go to exchanges um campaign exchanges of course you go to campaign bronze player exchange they're going to be a power player and a power pass exchange they haven't i don't i don't remember this being here before like i think they did so if you, if you exchange two bronze players right here you're gonna get a pack of about like 40 power up players you can pick one that you can use this one on a 62 to 81 so instead of leveling up to get it which can take a while you can go here put two bronze in and you get it so i just did it i got my power pass out of it it's a guys i cannot trust enough you can only do it once do it now once you do that guys you are going to go ahead and get i'm gonna probably count these real quick right here so we can see them as well um so i have unopened packs i have my uh pup which is uh power player fantasy pack this is the pack you get for the bronze you're gonna get a ton of a ton of power-ups a ton so you can so i would recommend you take one that you know you want to power up so we have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen sixteen eighteen twenty twenty two twenty four twenty six 28 30 32 so there's like 32 one for each team i suppose so here you go guys it's gonna be like an 80 overall from just about each team i just about maybe they double up on a few i don't i don't know um but yeah so i would recommend taking someone you could use so now at quick glance a good one is kyler murray uh kyle fuller shaquille griffin uh jadavion Clowney's not a bad one joe thuny's not a great one but it's decent devin bush is a pretty good one montez sweat's a pretty good one um and marshall a lot of more those would be the ones i do get one that you know you want to get in your team you can take this power up and then mix it with that power pass you just got and it, with like a, maybe like 50 to 100 training you'll probably be able to go ahead and power them all the way up so that's a pretty good free free like elite right there that's pretty much what they're giving you a free elite you're getting a free elite off this so definitely go ahead and take advantage of that and i already opened up the power fantasy pack which is the other one where you got that one power pass pack so you get that one so you get pretty much the guy now i will show you real quick for anyone who wants to know how to really power players as well because that's probably inclusive with uh, abilities as well so let me go back to my power at my homes here so guys, another thing you can do with power players is also that's how you put abilities on them and really get them maxed out the way you want. So down here would be the front art. As you can see here, there's a few art colors. You have this one, the elite. You can make him look like a power player, or you can make him look like his early access card, which is what I'm gonna want him to do because I actually prefer the early access card art over the power up card. I think it looks a lot cooler, and he's a power up card, of course. Then there's chemistries and positions. You can put this on him so you can go ahead and put him on the Chiefs team team as well. And in some cases, for other players, they will have other teams, right? Like players like Odell has been on the Cleveland Browns and the Giants, so he would have Giants and the Browns. Go ahead and do that. Then over here, you can see ability slots. This is how you put abilities on them. You can go ahead and place them. Every slot is better than the last. The first slot's gonna be the worst one, second's gonna be the second worst, and so on and so forth. All the way at the top is gonna be the best ones. Your X Factor is gonna be here. And then of course, this is your upgrade chain. As it goes on throughout the year, guys, this will get for longer. So eventually there'll be a 99 Mahomes. So it'll be like three cards that are based three three elite cards or whatever uh an elite a pro bowl card whatever and things you have to put throughout his set so you can use a power pass actually on him multiple times if you have the right power pass at the time you can use it on him. then let's say you don't Mahomes, you want a lamar jackson you're like damn i wasted my power passes you can go refund through the whole thing and get all those power passes back and we put them guys best tip i can give you guys that zerk told me a while ago make sure you do write down your power passes on a notepad or on your phone i like to do it on my phone because nothing's worse than mid july or no sorry mid december a bo jackson comes out because it always happens right bo jackson comes out and he has his base legend card but now he has his crazy christmas card you want to go power bo jackson bo jackson or randy moss's uh base cards go for like 300k now like crazy money that you have to use in the power up regardless so that's gonna be crazy that's gonna make a million coin card so you want to get your power pass and you're sitting there like who has it you're like it's Mahomes. you power down Mahomes. you waste all that training on refunds so you're only getting half back and it's not Mahomes. you go to saquon bark it's not him you end up unpowering down like three or four guys and you're like where the hell is it and you just lose a lot of money that way in time so make sure you guys are writing down where you use your power passes but yeah guys that's about it i mean that pretty much covers everything hopefully this in-depth video does help you guys out in the future if you guys have any questions comments or concerns head over to twitter dm me there comment them down below shout out in the poodle squad like the video and comment down below poodle squad and of course turn that noti bell and smash the like button you guys have been killing the support lately thank you for watching i'm out peace